Hi everybody. Thanks for checking out my infrared sauna vlog. So happy Monday and let's just put it out to the universe that this is going to be an amazingly productive and abundant and inspirational week for all of us. We're approaching the end of the year. We're approaching the holidays and that can be a very emotional time. And so I want to talk about how that as our world becomes more conscious, we, beco we become more empathetic and become more empaths to other people's energies and feelings and emotions especially. So in our lives and especially during the holidays when we are around people, that we're not usually around that may have a lower vibration than us. We have to protect ourselves energetically because we can take on the most intense energy in the room. And I realized that just today that, you know, I'm an empath and I'm very sensitive people to people's energy. And so I've had to really be able to construct these ways of, protecting myself from just becoming completely overwhelmed with other people's energy. And so got me to thinking about the holidays and how that is a time when emotions run high already. And then sometimes we're forced to be around people that cause have caused us great pain in our lives and or are enduring painful times. And so their energetic vibration may be very low. And sometimes people who play victims, as we discussed, or I discussed yesterday, um, tend to put blame on everybody because of their circumstances or whatever they're experiencing in their, in their life. And so it's really important to use tools to keep your vibration high and not take on the lower vibrational energies of those around you, especially when the most intense energy usually is the one that is able to overcome other energies, right? So this can be a pretty um, intense task. And I'll tell you there are some tools. Number one, get enough rest and nurture your physical body. And I talked about um, a whole prescription that I use during winter months for to maintain a high physical vibration. That's huge because you feel, if you feel physically depleted and you come into the um, energy of somebody that is very negative and or uh, aggressively putting their negativity on you, it can, it can knock you down, man. And that's when people get sick over the holidays, you know, it's a drag. Okay. So <clears throat> physical but physical vitality is really important <sighs> breathing <laughs> because when somebody's putting their energy on you a negative energy you can take it and expel it in your breath instantaneously that's a hugely powerful tool okay grounding meaning envision or feel their energy go into the ground and out the bottom of your heels and be absorbed by Mother Earth. Okay? <sighs> Try to take everything negative they say and think about it and envision it in the opposite, in a positive. That takes a lot of mental acuity. That takes a lot of focus with your brain and your third eye to be able to do that on the fly like that. But if you practice that, you can become quite adept. Stay out of their actual physical proximity within an arm's length or more. Don't allow them to come into your energy field. That's huge. That's very protective. And finally, Envision, and you don't, it, after you start practicing this stuff, it'll just be second nature. Envision a, a, a column of white or lilac or golden light surrounding you coming from source, which is, it's infinite. It, it, there's plenty. You get just boom, 
that's your protective. You do, nothing can penetrate that. That's of a, a lower vibration because higher vibrations always overcome lower vibrations, right? So take those tips and tools as we go into the holidays, as you have to be around people that can be very draining. Keep your physical body high, keep your spiritual and emotional and mental bodies high. I've got, holy mackerel, <laughs> I've got 50, 50 minutes to give or take, and it's already 136 degrees in here, baby. I'm going to be sweating. Whew. This is going to be a really good detox because um, sometimes we do things that toxify, and I discuss this, so it's, <laughs> oh, you got to detox, baby. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I'm going to say blessings to everyone. Blessings, blessings from my heart to yours in this holiday season. My heart open to yours. <sighs> breathe out any negativity and breathe in all the abundance and joy. And feel those feelings of gratitude that you already have everything you want in your life. And I mean everything. And give thanks for that. And it will be. All right, so I'm gonna meditate now and I'm gonna um, envision my perfect life and give thanks for what I have. And thank you so much for tuning in and please subscribe. Oh.